the team was unreal, man. I mean, I was working with so many different PhDs, people that worked on the Mars Rover project, people that worked in, because no one had built Hyperloop, so you had people from automotive and aerospace and defense and robotics and you name it coming in. And it was like such a dream team in a lot of ways, but yeah, yeah very difficult to get it done. Makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Well, and yeah, I mean, I know when I'm trying to do something difficult, I mean, and I'm sure when you are too, like you just look to like the nearest, you know, place where you can find the person that kind of sort of knows. Yeah. Uh, but nobody knows, but it's like, it's no, close no. enough. Yeah. yeah. And then the concept was changing throughout the time. So at first it was like, oh, we're going to levitate like this. And then it was like levitate like that. And then it was a vacuum and then it's this and that. And so many, and then how large the pod was or the shape. So every time you're doing that, like the, you've got the, aerodynamic side of it and you've got like the everything was different how the the tube was manufactured and how the um, oh man there was so many different things because then you're thinking about like just for cargo what that would look like yeah. and obviously quickly to market but then everyone's very excited by passenger so while i was there actually funny thing it changed names three times so when i joined it was hyperloop technologies but there was another company called hyperloop transportation technologies so after a while, we rebranded to Hyperloop One, and then throughout my tenure, Virgin got involved, and then Richard Branson came in. He was on the board, and we changed it to Virgin Hyperloop, or Virgin Hyperloop One, or something. Maybe it changed names four times. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> so it did all of that, and then a couple of years ago, it went back to Hyperloop One, and then they're now non no more, even erased off the internet. It looks like, which is crazy. Ah, brutal. <laughs> 